Hey guys! Hey everybody! <laughs> we are at the farmer's market. We just bought a lemon tree. Man, they want it. for that tree. <laughs> but yeah, we just bought our lemon tree. We're super excited about it. And now we're gonna get a bird. We are not getting a bird. <laughs> what? About three dollars. <laughs> All right. You having a good time? Yes. So this is really important to us because, you know, I mean, obviously it's easier to shop at the grocery store, but um, when you go to the farmer's market, you're supporting, you know, farmers and smaller companies versus, you know, like Harris Teeter or Walmart. It's like a huge company. Yeah, it's like a huge company. And it just means more if we support farmers or local farmers. So we're gonna, we plan to do this every week, right, babe? Yep. <laughs> All right, so we're leaving the farmer's market. Did you have a good time, babe? Yeah, I enjoyed it. It was really fun. You can see our lemon tree back there with Bentley. His name's Pedro. His name is what? Pedro. Okay. Apparently that's his name. So, we talked to a lot of people there, and all of them are, like, really struggling, and um, we're talking to one lady. We got some um, soap from her. It's, like, all-natural soap, and... Um, she was talking about how she's struggling to pay her bills and she said that her husband what'd you say he had cancer cancer yeah so like he's going through a lot and it's just they have a lot going on and like with everything going on with this virus and stuff you know um people aren't going out as much so they aren't selling as much so they are struggling and then um we talked to another guy and he sells baskets with his wife and they are struggling as well they just don't no one knows what to do and they were like just you coming even if you don't buy anything means a lot to us and that really stuck out to me because usually you know stores and corporations want you to buy stuff they don't want you to just come and talk to them so it was really cool so if anyone's in the area definitely stop by by the farmer's market and either buy something or just stop and say hello Look at their stuff. They have really great stuff. Like there's the soap one, a lot of fresh fruits and vegetables, meat, candles. Um, I don't even know what else. Just house knickknacks. Yeah. Oh yeah. Look at like that that shop with all the cute signs. Yeah. Like I mean, there's so much, and you're supporting a small business that has a big dream versus like I said, like a big corporation, like a big grocery store or something. It just really means a lot to them and I love supporting them and they honestly have great stuff. Like I'm excited about the all natural soap. What kind did you get? Vikings tip. Vikings do you know like like the scent? Like what was supposed to, like, you know? Mine was basil mint, which I'm really excited to try. I'll have to look at it and see what yours was. But we got that, we got our lemon tree, we got also got a bag of apples for George's mom. So we got a lot of nice stuff and it feels really good to support a smaller business. Um, at least like falling asleep. So yeah, and then we went to this lemonade stand that I really enjoyed. They, they were called was it Larger Than Lemons? Right, that was it. Larger uh, Than Lemons. I think so. Yeah, and they had great lemonade. They had they had regular lemonade. They had mango. They had strawberry. They said they even had a kiwi one. So it was really cool. And they offered to make me a special drink that's mango and strawberry. Lemonade. <laughs> so anyway, so if you are in the area, go ahead and check out those places and support those businesses. And we plan to go every weekend, right? Yeah. Y'all heard it. <laughs> I'm gonna hold them to it. <laughs>